you're thinking about in your head, sing and let them out. La di da di this fucking something, whatever. If it's not good, sing it. If it's good, sing it. But whatever it is, let it out. And when you let it out, um, you're not in your head. You're you're just letting it go. And when you do that, you you clear out the garbage, the crap, the bag that's been sitting back there for five years. You clean it out when you just can sing. It's similar to writing it down. So hallelujah, hallelujah. <laughs> so singing is a is a great option for getting yourself out of your head and getting more present and into your body. Um, another great place to put your conscious attention is on your feet. And really, oh yeah, and what's what's with the feet? Well, what's with the feet is they're far away from the head. <laughs> <laughs> so when you put your conscious attention to your feet. That's about as far as you can get from your head. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking awesome. So, put your conscious attention on your feet, and you're out of your head. You're in your feet. <laughs> and so you can focus on your one foot in particular, so just pick a foot and focus on it, and feel it, and feel how it feels on the floor, feel how it feels in your sock, feel how it feels in your shoe, feel how it feels when you're walking. And this might only be attainable for five to ten seconds and then when you feel like it's no longer attainable like switch to the other foot and then have your conscious attention there because guess what you're not in your head you're in your foot and you can do this for multiple body parts you can go for one see how long you can focus on it and then when you can no longer focus on that one switch to the other one and then do your arms do your knees send loving energy to all of them and now you're healing yourself too. Mm. So you can put your conscious attention on your feet. You can also put your conscious attention on, this is kind of a method that is, it takes some practice, but when you practice it, it's, it's a very effective method. And it is, you put your conscious attention on your throat chakra right here, and you imagine it and you imagine that it's working and now as thoughts come into your head you begin to count the number of words that come into your head you're not even you're not even narrating the thought you're putting your conscious attention on your throat chakra and as thoughts come into your head you count the number of words so you're not going to be saying the word let's say a sentence comes in let it happen comes into your head you count one, two, three. Okay. There were three words. So your conscious attention is on your throat chakra rather than in your head, in your thoughts, it's on your throat chakra. And now as thoughts come into your head, you begin to count the number of words that are coming in your head. One, two, and you do this. And as you count, you're becoming the awareness that's watching the words and now you're becoming the observer of your thoughts so that's another method to become more present another way of becoming more present is to practice the wim hof breathing technique and that is a technique would you like to try that right now we can yes sir um we, we can demonstrate it and it'll give more of a visual demonstration of how it works and it's it can sound so what it is it's 30 breaths in 30 uh like in and out very deep breaths and then on the last breath you release all the oxygen out of your body you suck your stomach in and just push as much out as you can on the 30th breath and then you hold it and then you're just in that moment meditating and focus on being and then once you can no longer hold you'll kind of feel yourself wanting to breathe like your diaphragm will go up wanting to take in a breath and then you just suck in as much air as you can and then you hold it again and then you just be in that place and then that completes it so and this is something that anybody that's watching can follow along right 
Yes, absolutely. So if you're not driving a car or anything that uh, anything physical, just have a seat and follow along. The thing with this technique too is that it can cause dizziness and all, and then some lightheadedness. So it's a great idea to sit down if you're about to try this with us. my chair as is one breath in one breath out and then we're going to begin the 30 How do you feel and what is some of the first things that you noticed um, coming out of that and during the entire experience? <clears throat> so the first thing that I noticed was lightheadedness, um, absence of thoughts, um, had a little bit of a tingling going on in my, in my brain I think. Sure, I felt the tingling sensation all the way up both my arms, so I can definitely relate to that.